Good morning, friends. It's still Taco Tuesday, and there's a sequel to Dragon Soft Tacos. So I had, 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 had to continue the story because they leave you hanging. They destroyed the house. They were working at building it, and they were eating more tacos. So you want to find out what happens next? Are you ready? Next story is <laughs> Dragon's Love. Tacos 2, the sequel. So it looks like they're back to eating more tacos. The sequel is by Adam Rubin and Daniel Salmieri. And this is another Scholastic publication. They're being wonderful and continuing to let us read these stories to you all while we are apart. <gasps> Look at that fancy, fancy waiter. Let's dig in, shall we? So this is where we left off. Hey kid, why are all your dragon friends crying? They look so sad. They don't look very happy at all, do they? <gasps> no more tacos, world in shock. Emergency supplies depleted, oh no. The taco scientists are baffled. The Congress is deadlocked on the taco issue. Oh my, we've got to do something about this. Listen to me, dragons. Don't freak out. No wonder they're upset. Dragons love tacos. Remember that time we had an awesome taco party with dragons? Well, there were so many tacos. Pant loads of tacos, big tacos, little tacos, beef tacos, chicken tacos, and... Because of a totally honest mistake, I'm not blaming anyone here, there were also some spicy tacos. Unfortunately, spicy salsa gives dragons the tummy troubles, and when dragons get tummy troubles, well, you know, we do know what happens for a while. But now, there are no more tacos, none, not a nil. If only we could somehow go back in time to our delicious taco party. For the spicy salsa, of course. We could save a handful of tacos, plant them in the ground and grow taco trees. So we never run out of tacos again and the dragons would be so happy. Well, I know we're not supposed to mess with it, but this does seem like the perfect opportunity to fire up that time machine in the garage. Hmm, good idea. <gasps> Ooh. A time machine lets you travel through time, back in the past when you were an itty bitty baby, or go forward to the future when you've grown into an old man, or in our case, back to the, ta the taco party full of tacos. That looks pretty big. These guys look really tiny compared to this big guy, huh? You know what? Let's strap into this gizmo and give it a whirl. Set the dial to taco party. Ready, set, zam. Hey, that's you from before. Weird. Well, there's plenty of tacos here. Let's just grab some and head back before the dragons eat any spicy. Uh-oh, crunch, crunch, crunch. Oh no, not again. I thought we missed all of that. They're still on fire. They're still hiding. We got one flying again through the air. Good gravy. Yikes. I sure hope this time machine still works. Poor house. Okay. Let's give the dial a little twist. We'll have to go a little bit further back this time before the dragons eat the spicy salsa. Ready, set, damn. Hmm, we may have gone a bit too far back. Crunch, crunch, crunch. Oh boy, not again. Okay, this time machine has seen better days. Try some machine oil, that might do the trick. Wait a second, that's not machine oil. 
Uh-oh. This may complicate our journey through time. Can you see it right there? It's extra spicy. Extra super duper spicy. Salsa. Oh, no. Dragons love diapers? That's not right. Let's try again. How silly. Tacos love dragons? Weird, but closer. One more time. Dragons love tacos. That's it. Look, we've got our pants. Pant loads of tacos. Dragons. Quick, grab some tacos and let's get out of here before it's too late. Crunch, crunch, crunch. Oh, are they going to make it? They've got their tacos. They're running. Are they going to make it? We made it. Congratulations. Oh, come on. You saved one. Phew. We'll plant a tree and have tacos forever. The dragons will be so happy. After all, dragons love diapers. I mean, tacos. Dragons love tacos. Heck, everyone loves tacos. Look at all those fun people. We've got some aliens and our dragons. we got our basketball players and astronauts and wizards. We've got Abe Lincoln. We got some boxers and the Statue of Liberty. Such a fun picture. Everyone loves them. And there's the diaper. I hope you guys enjoyed this book as much as I did reading it to you. Stay safe. Love you guys.